Are you serious? Are you serious? A sinkhole opened up in Philadelphia and swallowed a brand new car and has uh, knocked the water out. I mean, there's uh, 20 homes are without water and six homes are without gas. Uh, this sinkhole opened up this morning in the streets of Philadelphia, swallowed a car. Um, it's 30 foot wide and 10 foot deep and um and uh, this is just crazy what's going on uh Alyssa Banks who had a brand new car uh told Action News uh, I'm just a little overwhelmed it's it's not part of my visual vocabulary to come out and see your car in a giant sinkhole uh 20 homes have been left without water six homes without gas and the water department said the street has been blocked off. The repairs are trying to be done. Um, it's just kind of a, a, a mess in the city of brotherly love. Not a lot of love there swallowing this lady's car. But sinkholes continue to eat, open up in different parts of the world more and more frequently. It's like hell is being enlarged in that without measure. Matter of fact, the earth is pulling apart the crustal displacement. And this is part of what we're going to talk to BP Earthwatch about today. He'll be our guest 12 noon Eastern. The, the, a 7.3 earthquake hit the Philippines yesterday, but it was the deepest earthquake in history, 612 kilometers deep. What does this mean? That's all the way down to the magma. What? So we're going to try to find out some, some of the scientific understandings of that. Also, Comet 45P, Honda, it's, a, it's on its way, and there are, people are starting to get pictures of it. So what does that mean? It's going to come very close to the Earth. Not going to hit us, but we are going to go through its, we're going to travel through its tail. What does that mean? Could we have a few meteors? I don't know. Okay, but biblical signs are definitely in the heavens. And the Bible told us there would be signs in the sun, the moon, and the stars, distress of nations with perplexity, the sea and the waves roaring, and men's hearts failing them for fear, for looking after those things that are coming upon the earth. For the powers of heaven shall be shaken. Then shall you see the Son of Man coming in the clouds with power and great glory. And when these things begin to come to pass, he said, look up, lift up your heads for your redemption is drawing nigh. Are you saved? Give your life to Jesus Christ. Don't be left behind.